Okay, what's up everyone? My name is Rust Road Soft com and today we're going to review Norman. Now Norman is a really awful antivirus, I guarantee you. And there's no point of me even reviewing it because I know it's going to do a really bad job. So as a man, uh, well, I I made a promise to every every antivirus company that I'm going to give them everyone a fair chance. So first thing we have to do is make sure this product is up to date. Okay, the last update was on the 11.15 and it turned out 11.33 so we have to update it again. Is it updating? That we do not know. Well, I'm going to say that it is up to date because um, 15. I don't know. So let's like just really excited it and get it over with. Uh, so far, I grabbed uh, 13 links. Well, I'm, I'm sorry, 12 links. Because uh, someone, um, I had to at least make sure seven links work. Well, you know my routines, how I do, uh, how I make the reviews. Uh, link number one. Uh, man, I. Well, let me check. It's a fake AV. Um, this one's this one. These are really like uh, zero day old. So let me pause. Okay, the reason I had to pause is because I had to make sure nothing pornographic shows up. Because usually I want my videos to be um, PG. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It looks like they're offering some. F uh, I'm, I'm not sure if it's a real flash or not, but you know, to be safe, we're going to. Uh, let me pause. You know what, to be safe, we're going to download the real flash from real uh, site. But, uh, we're going to download the real, fl real flash from uh, from Adobe website. Because I don't know if that one is uh, real or could be some hacked version. If we go to if we go back to the site and thing pops up again, okay, session complete. We'll probably have to. Um, now let's see if, if let's see if we have flash. Okay, yeah, we do, we do. Yeah, I guess it's good. Let's uh, let's try this link one more time. No. Uh, Not sure what's going on. I keep getting redirected to those movies, movies online websites. You know. Um, hmm. I kind of don't trust these guys, so I'm going to say that number one has like failed or you know that does not exist because maybe this is a real legit site, but you know. Oh, man. We're going to let Mal Malabar decide it for it because it could be like a uh, hidden exploit. And look at this one's alive, so that's good. It could be like a hidden exploit on the site, and you know, can't be too careful. Okay, um, okay, yeah, this one's this one's blocked. So number one's blocked. That's very good. And I did get an email from one of the um, project uh, project manager from the Norman claiming that they they made their antivirus like real, like real like awesome or something like that. I'm going to remove this one because this one doesn't exist. That they made some changes to the antivirus and okay, it looks like that one does also does not exist. So. Oh, Trojan Trapper, that one's that one, if that one was real, it would be a really nasty one. Okay, this one's alive, so that's good. This one's also a nasty one. Oh, and it's blocked. Wow, very good. So, this one does. The num two links are blocked so far. And this, could be, this one's supposed to be number three. It's supposed to be. Hmm? 
I can see my um Okay. Indirect program is trying to connect to the internet, yeah. Well yeah, I do wanna connect to the internet. I can see my network activity, something's going on, okay. Um I couldn't classify that I wasn't unsure because maybe malware but it's okay, it's a new it's a new uh, new split, so oops. I made a lot of mistake. Yeah, so that's a uh, uh, going on. So, huh. Oh, this one's alive, so that's good. Okay, I had my mouse on the pause button. Okay, this one definitely went through. Yeah, uh, this program, this program into Explode is trying to connect to the internet through uh, some exe something something. Um, hmm, I know, it doesn't give you like um going, outgoing uh, application. Huh, I'm going to deny because I'm going to say that one failed. Uh, yeah, we did this one already. Blue disk dot ru. Okay, so wait a minute. Yeah, just like I thought we I think we're infected. Okay, I just have to make sure that the link was covered up. If something weird pops out, we have to make sure. Uh, basically, we keep get we keep re get redirected to some advertisements from some advertising websites. Yeah, all we do is get uh, redirect to some advertisement websites. So. Um, for example, let's say I go to yahoo.com. We do, go, we, we, we do go to Yahoo, but um, we're definitely infected. Okay, we can see now. Okay, let's see. Let me see something else here. Yeah, we have an proxy enabled. So, so, so something had enabled a proxy on our computer, so we have to remove that. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. But, you know, let me try to throw this, a uh, few of these links. See if, uh, see if they can go through. Because we keep, we keep getting rendered to some advertisement websites. Yeah. Landscaping. Yeah, probably um, those uh, they're they're dead. So you know, we, let's uh, just run scan them out by see how well that this thing really did. What the heck is? Um and look, it claims only that if it quarantined only one file. That's not right. Something called W uh, W thirty two uh, Rust Rustak Rust 
are you stuck? I don't know, I could be on the hold on, let me see something else. A few weeks ago I was messing around with um peer to peer and download things. And I stumbled onto a um the Georgian uh, hotbox I think it's called. Well I think it was Clearwire. Um no that's Clearwire, how was it called? Limewire, Limewire. Limewire, Clearwire is a, it's an internet company. Oh yeah, those guys are awesome by the way, Clearwire. Okay, yeah, a few weeks ago I was, uh, I think it was um, one of the reviews I made, but I don't remember which one. I think it was a stop sign or I don't, I don't remember. Whoa. You know, it's being installed like it's nothing there. Yeah, I know this thing really carries some uh some some backdoor thing. Hmm. Let's let's try to launch in this clear uh, lime wire plus plus with an X. I mean with an with a plus sign at the end. Oh now it's trying to block it. Wow. Yeah, good job. Into a radio. Okay, let me see. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, I found some. Yeah, I found two infections. Yeah, this this doesn't make sense. Okay, I know a LimeWire Plus was like a, it, um, it cost money, but how come like uh, I don't, I don't get this. Yeah, and trust me, LimeWire has been disabled. It's not a low, it's not a LimeWire Plus. One Visa, Master X Express, uh, Scarra, PayPal, or I think it's a, it's a check. So, and look, uh, if you guys watched my uh, phishing videos, when I made made about those fake two fake uh, emails I received from uh, uh, Wachovia and the other bank, I don't, which I don't remember, uh, I'm going to start making more v videos like that. Like, I have to make sure you guys are more secured from. Um, scams like phishing or I don't know Nigerian emails because like I said before I don't know how do they f how they find your information how do they get your emails I know what they do actually I had to make a few phone calls so I'm gonna let it scan and I'll be right back after I'm done after it's just finished scanning okay now what we're going to stop there is going to end this right now okay what about you guys get line uh not line more yeah right what I recommend you guys get Norman, it's a big no because look, okay. If I see any infections right here, the product is not safe. Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty stupid, you know. Uh, even they claim they uh, they have been like, they changed, like um, they added new features, you know, blah, blah, blah. This product still sucks. So thanks for watching. Uh, uh, I apologize if I um, used some bad language. I, this product sucks and thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later on. Bye bye.